Even in the midst of darkness, there are stars illuminating the night sky. Even in the midst of a fortunate uh, misfortune, one can find luck. Even in the midst of a crisis, one can find opportunities. Likewise, our mind that has been agitated by things that have gone wrong in our life and in this world can also find peace and happiness through meditation practice. So let us meditate together now. So finding your comfortable place, sit upright. Mm -hmm. Either sitting on the floor, on the chair, to sit upright, your hands resting on your lap, right hand over that left hand, the tip of your right index finger touch your left thumb, close your eyes. Lightly and gently. Relax the whole body. Starting from your head, your eyebrows, your eyelids. Put a little smile on your lips, your neck, along your shoulders, your arms, your lower arms, your hands, all the way down to the tip of your fingers. Then your trunk, chest and abdomen. Your back, lower back. Your hip, your thighs. The upper part of your legs. The lower part of your legs. Feet till the tip of your toes. Relax. Every muscle should be relaxed. Make sure there are no signs of tension remaining in any part during your meditation practice. With the right posture, you will have the feeling you can sit for as long as you like. You feel as you are grounded. You'll be apart where you are sitting right now. Your position quite firm and stable and checkable. Once you settle your sitting posture, you have nothing left to worry or concern your physical. That will allow your mind journey toward to your center. Now free your mind from all burdens, all responsibility. Clear all stuff in your head. Empty your mind. Fill your mind with joy and happiness. Don't let anything to bother you. This is the moment that you are doing for yourself to find the peace, the happiness within.
Then picture your whole body clear, crystal clear. Just as the entire body consists of pure elements, it is clear, pure body, hollow inside, without any organs, just empty space, hollow inside. Draw your attention back to yourself. Notice your breath at the turning point of your breath. That is your center. The center of the body located right above the navel level, two fingers. At the end of your deep breath, that is your center. Allow your mind return back home. It is your bunker. It is your safe zone from all defilements. It is the only place on earth to find the true peace, the true happiness. So the true happiness is within us. The people seeking outside never find the true happiness. unless we find him inside our body. Your, jo your journey will begin when you might come to settle at the center of your being, at the center of the body. So now place your mind lightly, gently at the center the body like a feather falling down to settle upon the surface of water lightly gently keep your awareness at that location feel it at your gut feeling Maintain your mind within at the focal point, at the center of your being. Allow your mind become oneness. That's mean you have to draw all your senses, become one. At a single spot, at the center of the body. But do not force yourself at all. Take it easy. Relax. Don't make it hard. Don't make it difficult. Do it simple, easy, also relaxed. Simple, easy. Relax. These are your true companion along your journey. So don't force yourself at all. Take it easy, relaxed, at the center of your being. Keep your awareness at the center point. The center of the body is the center of gravity. It is the doorway, the gateway, allow one access to the hidden knowledge. 
in order to maintain your mind within at the center of the body you may imagine a object pick up the easy one the simple one but the most effective one is to be clear rounded like a crystal bubble the moon the sun that these bright clear object falling at the center of your being these bright clear object as your own mind which is bright and clear floating at the center of your body feel as the object is being a part of you you also being a part of the sphere the light you are one each other the entire body dissolve or melt away become one with the light the energy the crystal sphere so what is remaining only the feeling of joy the feeling of calm the feeling of happiness inside pursuing this positive energy on and on over and over don't let your mind be distracted maintain your mind like this at the center point in the middle of the sphere at the center of your being so enjoy this moment on and on over and over looking for nothing just observe let it be observe the feeling relaxation relax just relax allow your mind become one don't let your mind being away stay still let it be any experiences may arise just observe let it be do not interrupt your experience allow your inner experience unfold in a natural way without any expectation just observe let it be so this is the possible way to maintain your mind by imagining a bright clear object the thinking method the practitioner may recite the mantra or the magic word repeating the mantra to yourself silently 
mentally five syllables. Sam ma a ra an Sam ma ra Sam ra Sam ra Sam ra Just like the mantra coming from within at the center of your being, deep inside. Sama Araham. Sama Araham. Sama Araham. Repeat the mantra over and over, again and again, until the sound of the mantra fade away, until you feel that enough, you prefer to continue without the mantra, then just leave it at that moment. Just in case you need it, because you might too busy, then the mantra will helpful. Will help you to maintain and draw your attention back to yourself. So now continue your journey toward to the center. Keep your mind still. Pursuing the energy at the center point until we come to the appropriate time. Enjoy your saying inside at the center of the body.
Keep your mind still. Don't let your mind wander. Maintain your mind at the center of the body. Allow your mind become oneness at the center point. Be one with the bright shining sphere. As you are a part of the sphere, you are inside the light. You are inside this pure energy. As you are the light, the, the light is a part of you. You become a part of the light. It is the light of peace, the light of happiness, the light of joy. Let us share this moment, the energy throughout the world. Let this pure energy embrace the entire body to eliminate all the negative energy. Once you hit the brightest spot, the energy will be expand like a ripple expanding. The new one arise in the middle one by one, one by one. The new one keep coming from the middle to replace the previous one. As you are passing through the stream of light, the tunnel of light, you're going toward to the center, at the center, deeper and deeper. This energy expanding wider and wider. Let the energy embrace the whole room where you are meditating now. So the entire room turn to clear forms, pure forms, so everything turn to a clear object. So the energy is spreading out to cover your whole accommodation, the whole place, spreading out to the whole community. the whole city, across the other cities, the whole state, the whole country, the whole world, without boundaries, no exception. Generate the feeling of kindness, friendliness toward all beings. Whoever receive or get in touch 
with this energy. May they be free from physical suffering, mental suffering. May they be free from all harm, all perils. May they be happy. So let us sharing this positive moment, the positive energy throughout the world. And lastly, recall the wholesome deed that you just done, all the merit you did before. Put this energy together, forming a sphere of merit inside of you. This is a sphere of merit shining inside. Bring all the one you love, your parents, your children, whoever you care. So bring all of them inside the energy. Wish them for peace, good health, longevity, be able to attain the true happiness. May they be free from all harm, all disease. Including yourself. Once everything is done, you just maintain your mind at the center point. Keep the energy with you. Ape Putta Palapata Pate Gananja Yang Palang Arahanta Nanja Te Chena Rakantha Mi Sapaso Sapaputta nupave na sapatama nupave na sapasangha nupave na sata asoti pa wanto te. Take a deep breath. Really open your eyes. Hi Tong, how are you? You just come in? Yes, Long P. <laughs> I mean, I came in for a while, but I was um, at the door. I, nobody let me in. <laughs> <laughs> you sit behind Shuri Blossom? Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big tree. <laughs> So, how about your, your meditation? Have good meditation, Steve? Uh, sleepy. Sleepy. Yeah, but it was good. Hot? <laughs> too much, too sleepy. <laughs> why? Can you find the reason why you feel sleepy? You sleep less? You work too, too much during the day? No, just just uh, not too much, not enough sleep last night. Oh, <laughs> you meditated with us last night? Uh, did I? No, not last night. No. All oh, right. Yeah, I 
I have trouble when I um, when I'm sleepy. What what do you suggested? I think you you said to just kind of wake yourself up and then go back in. Rub, mm -hmm. Oh, I think you said rub your arms, right? Forgot about uh, that. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There are many techniques to help you to keep you awake. Yeah. Mm. But they have to find the reason, uh, the, the cause of your sleepiness. Mm. So if you sleep, uh, if you sleepy, and because of your sleepless during the night, then you have to arrange or manage your time to sleep. Yes. Make sure that you have enough uh, hours to sleep. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Otherwise, no, it's hard to con to control the body, yes. including me. So when I sleep less, then I'm I'm tired as well. <laughs> <laughs> Last night we have a meditation uh, with uh, you know boss cat from from uh, the internet, you know, and we're sitting meditation all around the world uh, regarding the the bird. Uh, Birthday of our master, Paul, the much of your birthday. So it's, uh, he said, Earth Day is my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> so we meditate uh, and do uh, the chanting from 9 to 12, <laughs> almost wow. three hours. We have a lot of activity at the temple, but we, we, I have uh, on online, you know. Yes. There are many participants uh, meditate with us, just like they are at the temple. <laughs> good, good. Mm -hmm. Heather, how about you? No, today's session was really good. It was really helpful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I feel like I think Joyce said the other day that the situation is her making making her, um, you know, realize how much she, she likes to control things. So I can definitely echo that. Mm -hmm. I think for me, one of the things this whole situation is making me really focus on is today, and I think it's really helping me. I, you know, you usually always plan the weekend or you plan for that next thing, and I feel like in this plan or think about that next step or that next thing. So for me, I feel like it's really helping me just be in the moment, be in today. So that's been a good, um, you know, the silver lining, I guess. Mm -hmm. Have to let let it go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't let anything to bother bother you. you know, that learn to detach from all stuff. Just right. maintain your mind, stay still. But this is your your moment that you are doing for yourself. Right, to find you know the true happiness, so everyone's seeking for the true happiness. So it's, this is the most important thing, important thing for your life. So not let anything to interrupt you. You just stay focused, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for your sharing. Thank you. How about you, Lily? I'm doing good. The situation you. is getting better. Uh, yeah, well, I just have to wait. Um, some chanting last week. Mm -hmm. uh, so, um, I just have to wait for the problem to be. It need uh, it need times. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. It would take um, a good couple of weeks to be able to, for them to um, go out the Right, right. Hope, hopefully that you can, you know, pass through these uh, uh, difficulties in your work. Yeah, I to stay positive and uh, yeah. let it be and be patient. Yeah, yeah. Meditate and toward to the end before you ending your practice you know think about the whole Sunday that you have done all the good things that you did before and then make a good wish you, you stay at 
and the, and your center in you know just like you are inside you know the the crystal sphere you inside yeah. the energy and then you make a make a good wish at that moment yeah you picture yourself that can pass through that difficulties yeah mm -hmm. i Try to thank you. Okay, thank you so much for your sharing. How are you, Ramsey? You have a busy day? Oh, no. Uh, yeah, so uh, it was kind of stressful today with work. So this was really helpful. Hmm. Yeah. You still work online at, uh, at home or do you? Yeah. I have to work from home. Yeah. Uh, you work from home, right? Yeah. How many hours? Oh, this... <laughs> so any, um, anywhere from six to ten hours. Ah, right. I mean, on an average, it's eight, but some days it's like six. Some days I have to work more. Right. It's depend on on you, right? Then you can arrange it at your time, your own time, right? Yeah, yeah that's true. Mm. Okay, then how about your meditation? Do you meditate every day? I'm trying to, so I try to meditate like for 15 minutes before going to bed. Okay. Um, so I try to do that at least like three or four times a week. Oh. Um, but um, eventually I want to do it daily. I used to do it daily, but I lost some practice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I want to restart it. Yeah. yeah. So if you need some uh, guideline, uh, in instruction, so on the the link that we uh, said before, you know, meditation against COVID nineteen. <laughs> yeah, I have a, a, a good uh, instruction from our our monks. Uh, there are uh, a lot. Uh, there are several video clips that you can you know. Turn, on, turn it on and then you follow the instruction of uh, the monk. Okay, yeah. yeah. I'll check it out. Thank you. Game, how about you, Game? Mm -hmm. You disappear <laughs> quite a while. <laughs> yes. Good to see you back. Uh, today, my meditation, uh, I my mind was distracted by my thought mm. sometime, mm -hmm. but I try to bring it back. Yeah. Again and again, yeah. actually. Yeah. There is no other solution. <laughs> yes. <laughs> just be mindful. Once you realize that all oh, your mind being away, then just, you know, bring it back. Right. That's it. <laughs> no matter how many times that you have to do in that. <laughs> yes. Because the true peace, the true happiness is inside of you, and the gateway is at that spot, that tiny spot, right? And that allow you to get through. So if you being away from your center, that means you are you are away from the true peace, the true happiness. You need to be back home. <laughs> that is your bunker. That is your safe zone. So don't leave your home, <laughs> okay? <laughs> then you are in trouble. Mm -hmm. I used to talk a lot about the, uh, the hindrances. Do you still remember? There are common obstacles that uh, happen to, you know, to everyone, even, even me. You know, less or more, it depends each time. So let me review these five hindrances. Okay, the first one uh, regarding to your senses. We have five perceptions, right? Your five perception is just like a doorway that allow you know the enemy go to your home. You have to box, you have to close all the doors when you are meditating. Okay, the idols, the ears, your nose, your 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 mouth, and your the, the mind itself. So that is the uh, the entrance that you have 
to shield, you have to protect it. Do not allow any unwelcome <laughs> object go to your mind. Okay. So that is uh, the first thing that you have to concern. Be uh, guarded your or protect your sense because sense desire when your your perception uh, require you to you know to feed <laughs> those kind uh, those uh, 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 those you have to know how to deal with it just ignore it Okay, the first one sense desire. The second one is uh, a negative feeling, negative thought that we call ill will. Okay. Angry, unpleasant feeling, upset. So any kind of negative feeling, it will block you from, uh, you know, inside. Not do not allow you go inside. Then you have to move oh. away. Right, get rid your unpleasant feeling. Don't let it control your heart. Okay, it will cause you unable to bring your mind settle. Okay, that is the second hindrance. The third one, sleep, <laughs> sleepiness. My sleepiness. Um, there is a there is a monk. He's uh, the chief disciple of the Lord Buddha. He has a psychic power, and so when he become the enlightened one, uh, but before he achieved that ability, when he meditated, he's always falling asleep. So uh, they are ask, asking him, uh, the way or the method to overcome his sleepiness to you know the, the Buddha. So then the Buddha give him uh, uh, suggestion the way to overcome the sleepiness. You know, when you meditate, then so you have to know the natures of mind when your mind is have no activities. If you, you know, just like the one who get tired of falling asleep, you have to put something to let your mind doing something, put some activity for your for your mind, but not too much <laughs> activity, right? It may make you go crazy. So the Buddha suggests that uh, his uh, monk, yeah, monk have to review the method that. Uh, he learned from you know, uh, the Buddha. So review the teaching. You know, guess, you know, when, when the monk review the method, then the mind have some activity. Right? So, so when you have some activity, then you can continue further your, you know, your meditate, your meditation. So if you might, if this uh, suggestion unable to help you to overcome the sleepiness, you still feel sleepy because your the mind is too hard, uh, too too weak. So then the second uh, step, you uh, rub your body, yeah, pull your ear, yeah, to make yourself awake, refresh yourself, refresh yourself, and. Try again if you feel sleepy. So let's move to the first step. So the practitioner should open your eyes because when you're sleepy, just like uh, the the darkness is overcome your heart, your mind. So you need to open your eyes. Uh, right, look the the light around you. Okay, once you refresh yourself and try again, if you're still sleepy, 
Then move to the fourth step. Get up. Now have a glass of water. Wash your uh, wash your face. And come back. Meditate. If you feel still sleepy, then the last step. <laughs> Go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> That's yes, the last option. <laughs> because you are too weak, your body too weak to support not to meditate at that moment. You, so you cannot control yourself at, at all. And once you take a nap, you recover from your sleepiness, then you will be able to further your meditation. So this is the... the the teaching from you know from the Buddha to his uh, chief disciple. So then the monk follow his uh, uh, instruction. And then he will uh, he be able to overcome his sleepiness and then he attain he become the enlightened one. Okay. Okay. Now move to the fourth hindrance. The monkey mind. So this one is so popular. <laughs> it's happened to every, every everyone, including me. So when you have a lot of activity during the day, you have a lot of uh, thing to concern or worries. If you disturb your meditation a lot, uh, the monkey mind, you might go around <laughs> from one matter go to another. Just like a monkey jump from uh, one branch to another, on and on, over and over. You have to know how to deal with your monkey mind. You have to tame your monkey mind <laughs> or train your monkey mind. The way to, to deal with your, your monkey mind, that is using... Uh, the the object, a bright object. You have to stay focused on an object at a time. Not not too many not too not too many object at a time. Um, so the tame your monkey mind right by using a object. You know, put uh, keep the, your monkey. You know, put you know like a Get uh, put the banana to your monkey. Right? The monkey will pay with the banana. <laughs> you have to to you know, using some uh, uh, skill, uh, some tool to 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 let your mind you know focus on a object, so you will not going away. Right, just stay focused on a on a object, and also the mantra. Right, samarang samarang. So, if, when you have too many objects at a time, you spend a lot of energy. You lose your energy, right? You spend too much, cause you to feel tired eventually. Right? So the mantra also helps you to draw you back to your center. Okay. And the last one is uh, doubt. When you meditate, you have question question or doubt is make you sorry Okay, <laughs> doubt will make you hesitate. So, when you drive your car and you are on you know, three-way street, it make, make you hesitate. Which direction that you should go to? So you're unable to go, you know, go further. When you have a doubt as well, because you are unable to 
passing through that state of mind. Okay. What you have to do when you have doubt, you know, let, let it be. Okay, let it be. Just, you know, whatever happened, just, you know, let it be. Let your, allow your experience unfold in, in a natural way. Do not interrupt it. Don't, you know, no question. So that will, your inner experience will, you know, go develop further and deeper. So if you doubt, you stop at that moment. You cannot go further. So these are the five common hindrances that happen to everyone. So one, the practitioner be able to overcome this uh, five obstacle, you might become oneness. So then the real, the true journey is begin at that moment. Okay. Sorry, Long Peak. Um, can you give us some examples of, doubt? for example, when you meditate and you saw light and you, you, you kind of, you are not sure what it is. Is it the, the right yeah. one? Mm -hmm. Okay. Could you yes, give me, yeah, like you give Lily. Us some examples about doubt. Mm -hmm. Like Lily, when you said that you, when you meditate, you, you, you saw a light inside of you and it make you scared, right? Yeah. Uh-huh. So then when you feel scared, you out of, uh, it cause you uh, out of the, um, you, you stop your experience. Yes. So then you stop, you stop your experience, so then your inner ex experience unable to develop further. So this is a kind of doubt. Doubt it cause you scare. It cause you hesitate. Or when you meditate, you have other inner experience, uh, such as the body. You you might feel that the body getting bigger, bigger and bigger, and you feel strange, weird, and you question. When you question, so this kind of experience will stop again. Or some meditator feel that the body getting smaller and smaller. You question, you doubt, oh, what happened to me? Oh. <laughs> so when you question, you are experiencing inner experience stop okay this is a kind of you know Out. this is the the procedure uh that the mind going to be oneness don't stop do not interrupt your inner experience or when you perceive the light uh you know, like the, the light is, is moving toward you. Don't be scared. Just pass it through. Be neutral. No matter in the experience happened to you, even good or bad or weird, even good, it, it, it makes you feel oh, so good, feel happy. When your mind check. The, the experience will stop. Be neutral, no matter if it, it, it just look good. You have, you feel that, oh, we have very good experience. Don't do that. When you, your mind is not, uh, not neutral, the experience will stop. And they're able to develop deeper. So this is tired, you know. Doubt that cause you hesitate, unable to go further. So whatever happened when you meditate, just be neutral. Let it be. Let it go. Right. Yes. So 
Is there anyone have questions? And no. to give you more information about to overcome sleepiness. Um, in other uh, Buddhist scripture uh, mention about uh, sense control, if you do not control your senses, it can cause you, you know, during the day, uh, no, uh, the first one, sense control, right? And then second one, um, cont uh, my uh, moderate in eating, moderate in eating, do not eat too much not eat do not eat too late too less right if you eat a little you feel hungry right but if you eat too much you feel full <laughs> it, it causes you to feel uncomfortable it's easy to falling asleep right? if you eat, eat too less just eat a little you feel hungry <laughs> that is also not so not good right you have to moderate in eating make sure that you eat enough but not too much right. and the, the other uh, as an other step you have to uh, manage or arrange your time to get up to sleep make sure that you uh, sleep enough during the day right uh, during the night time right. and what else yep something like it yeah you have to concern you know yep. mm -hmm. don't any issues any question any <laughs> No question. No question. <laughs> yeah. Question is. Yep. Okay. Thank you so much for your participation and spend your time together this evening. Hope that you all be safe and be protected by the Triple Gem. May you be easy to attain the true peace, the inner peace within, and pursue your perfections until you all reach the Nirvana and the Admiral Dharma. Thank you so much. Thank you. Please pay respect to the monk by bowing three times. Bow. 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 Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> so everyone see you again on Saturday. Good Saturday. Okay. Take good care, Lily, everyone. Thank Stay you. safe. Stay happy. Thank you. <laughs> happy Earth Day. Happy Earth Day. <laughs> yeah, today is Earth Day. Let's Bye, game. Let's sing together. You the world. Bye, Tom. <laughs> <laughs>